latest changes to the UK immigration rules. The UK government has publicised the new amendments to the immigration rules. Have you visited our website? We have hundreds of updates regarding UK visa and immigrations. Also, if you haven't subscribed the channel, please subscribe now and press the bell icon to get the latest updates on your screens. On the 7th of March 2019, the government has announced numerous changes to the immigration policies, which shows its promise to invite best talent, at the same time also cracking down on exploitation. The rules will offer skilled businessmen entry to two brand new visa categories to start businesses in the United Kingdom. The start-up visa path will be accessible to those beginning a business for the first time in the United Kingdom, whereas the innovator visa path will be for more practiced businessmen who have finances to capitalize in their business. Both paths will meet approving bodies and business specialists instead of the United Kingdom Home Office evaluating candidates' business concepts. This will make certain that the paths are determined on only the most groundbreaking, feasible and accessible businesses. Together with these new paths, the United Kingdom Home Office is also introducing improvements to the Tier 1 investor route. The improved route will better defend the United Kingdom from unlawfully acquired finances, at the same time making sure that authentic investors have right to use to a possible visa route. Applicants will be obligated to demonstrate that they have had power of the compulsory £2 million for a minimum of two years, instead of 90 days, or show proof of the source of those finances. The United Kingdom Home Office will also lengthen the salary immunity in the Tier 2 general visa to make sure that the NHS and schools can carry on inviting and appointing experienced tutors, nurses and paramedics from outside the United Kingdom. The salary exclusion relates to every nurse and paramedic, medical radiographer and secondary school tutor whose topics are in maths, physics, chemistry, computer science and Mandarin. A two-year policy, which will permit up to approximately 20 nurses from Jamaica to arrive to the United Kingdom, to attain dynamic skills in NHS hospitals as component of an exchange scheme, has also been revealed. The government has previously braced and repositioned over 1,000 courageous Afghan translators and their diarists, so they can reconstruct their lives in the United Kingdom. Nevertheless, in respect of their cooperation for the United Kingdom's armed forces, the United Kingdom Home Office is introducing rules amendments, so that entitled spouses and kids of translators stuck in Afghanistan, can move to the United Kingdom soon. Caroline Noakes, Immigration Minister after observing the modifications, stated. My main concern is, ensuring that capable businessmen carry on to consider the United Kingdom as an appealing destination, to grow their businesses. This will assist generate more professions within the United Kingdom, and make sure our economy carry on booming. Also greeting those, who desire to become a part to our economy, we also value our responsibility to help the ones in a weak opposition. That is why, I am pleased that we are prolonging our promise, to the bold Afghan translators and their families so that they can reconstruct their lives here, as one, in protection. On the other hand, what we will not stand is, those who pursue to misuse our structure and that is why I am introducing new actions, which will ensure that only authentic investors, who desire to boost United Kingdom businesses, can gain from our immigration system. Further modifications to the United Kingdom policies include the record of nations, which take advantage from the updated documentary requirements, located in Appendix H, has been revised to include Brazil, Kazakhstan, Mauritius, Oman, Peru and Tunisia. This modification will not only give advantage to students, who will be able to apply for visas via a more efficient procedure, but also aid to make sure that the United Kingdom's world-class education foundation stays modest worldwide. We are adding the original period of leave, permitted to those who are eligible for stateless leave from 30 months to 5 years, making it stress-free for those who are actually refugee, and not able to live in any other nation and harsh needless system of government. Moreover, to discourage those who seek to misuse the system to take advantage from stateless leave, modifications are being made to the guidelines, to ensure that only those who are actually eligible to stateless leave can succeed. 
This makes fairer that, a person is compelled to demonstrate that they have attempted to acquire a nationality, or right of residence in another nation that they could practically imagine to be eligible to, before getting advantage from stateless leave. The government is sure that, they will not put up with those who try to play the procedure to remain in the United Kingdom. This government keep on being dedicated, to bring net migration down to justifiable degree, but also realizes the demand to invite individuals who bring values to the United Kingdom, and allow business owners to have access the talent and skillfulness they require.